A while back we took in a golf cart project and it's a, a six seater so it's a, it's a longer version of a golf cart mm -hmm. and the guy wanted this thing to look like rock and roll. He puts on a concert every year in Oklahoma called Rock Lahoma. So he wanted this golf cart to represent Rock Lahoma. It already came in with a lift, fancy wheels and tires, had stereo in it. Someone already started working and building this thing. It just needed a little bit of a facelift. That's when we came up with the idea of rebodying this thing. We found a fiberglass body that was wicked cool. The gentleman is really into Fords, not so much Chevy, sorry. Um, found the body. Uh, it didn't even come close to fitting on the golf cart, so that's when it went to Ghetto Bob, and Ghetto Bob cut this body 10 ways to Sunday to make it fit on this golf cart. That just started with Ghetto Bob. Then he started putting stereo in it. And it was something else. You gotta see this. I'm excited to tell you about this golf cart right here. It looks like it's simple, just a normal everyday body and it's just a, another badass paint job by Ryan and the guys. But this body started out nowhere close to even thinking about fitting. It's been stretched, it's been sectioned. Uh, basically it's not even for this golf cart or a six seater, but it's done. Took a ton of work. First thing we did was we stripped this body down to nothing but just a frame rail in there. Then we made the body fit. This body is not made for a six seater golf cart. And of course, as you can see it, it's got six seats on it now. The next step was to take all the audio equipment from Fosgate that he had in there, rework it, make it look like it belongs in a golf cart, not on the back of a boat. This thing's got three amplifiers over 1500 watts of Rockford Fosgate's marine power equipment. This thing is loud, man. You're gonna hear it coming two, three blocks from here. Then we wrapped the seats in some faux alligator. Then we accentuated it with nothing but LED, multicolor changing lights that are all underneath this thing and in the roof of this. It's also got air suspension on it. To raise it up, lower it down you get a bunch of big people in the back of it you want to lift it up so you don't drag around all that's all new valves all new plumbing new compressor system and then we had to paint it tons and tons of bodywork hours tons of hand pinstripe stuff by ryan man this thing is just insane so if you guys want to check this thing out up close and personal it'll be at rocklahoma in prior oklahoma come check it out